our community we put in generators at the Buckin Roadhouse and also had a generator fitted up at Corinda Park further upwards Blanapy. So that allowed us to make sure we had fuel accessible and also food should there be some sort of outage or some sort of disaster again. So this particular project we've already seen benefits from it. More recently we had a power outage for a whole day and that meant that the roadhouse was still able to run their bowsers and still able to do cooking for the community. So I think the messaging we'd like to send to the Community Foundation was a huge thank you to have the ability to put in a generator for our community. We're a resilient little community and we are a tight-knit little community but there are things like that that at the time of the bushfires in particular we really identified that we needed. So it's been an essential and I guess it builds a level of safety for the community knowing that we have access to those resources within the town. I think some of the elements of excitement we have within our community is we've now got a tourism opportunity plan and we have got a plan actually for the town. There is a bit of a focus on tourism and leveraging off the Buck and Caves and really trying to bring people back into the town and, and for it to feel more alive. This particular resilience project was one of the most recent projects so it's the one that we've been able to finally deliver on which has been really exciting for the community. To see these other projects be finalised would be um, I think a bit of a feather in the cap for the community and for the committee as well to finally see the realisation of some of these other projects. To have the opportunity to work with the foundation in the future would be fantastic. I think because the projects are very grassroots and they are definitely you know from the locals for the locals and because it was such a seamless process I think it would be great to have that opportunity to work further with them in the future.